Hello, we're back. <laughs> uh, wait, you're not in the center though. What the fuck? Uh, there. Ah, uh, wait. Uh. <laughs> I, uh, uh, wait. Uh. Ooh, let's go YouTube then. So, where is it? Was it addition? No. Oh yeah, here. So YouTube.com. Let's put you there. Uh, grade A. Grade A. Huh? これ? これか? Uh, what do you want me to watch? World's Last Yes Foods? This one? Ne, 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 kore? Uh, World's Last Yes Food? Come on, let's just balut. What ass? Why would you eat ass? Why oh, is there an ass here? Ah. <laughs> ah. Uh, fuck. Uh. Okay, Sir Alice. Hello. Wait. Is my Instagram here? You know what? Uh, how about... I don't know if I... Must yes, but it's okay. Yeah, or not yet. Yeah, you're messaging me again. Sorry. Uh, here. <laughs> oh no. Oh, there we go. We have a lot. Uh, is it Christmas lunch? <laughs> okay, this one? So... That's a bit... Too loud. What that? Kore? That's just balut though. Right, right. Some of the food people eat in other countries is disgusting. So I've been watching a lot of travel shows recently, right? You know the ones where some guys travel around the world visiting new countries and trying local foods. And all the hey. they'll go out and find some of these dishes that are said to be local delicacies, right? Except for one problem. There's nothing delicate or delicious about them at all. <laughs> they're disgusting. Things that no one in their own. Wait. Oh no. Uh, wait, there's no avatar. Fuck. No wonder. Uh, uh game capture. Wait. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Wait. Uh, where's monster blocks? Let's just copy this. Put that here. Right. Paste it here. Yes. Oh. Uh, where should we put this here? Uh, okay. <laughs> Sa, iko yo. These are dragon clothes. Lamb's heads, gray. Lamb heads. Crickets, water beetles. Caterpillar. Some big spiders, anyway. Those, those are. What the fuck? They're not. They're not disgusting. They're all tasty. You're not disgusting, you're just idiots. <laughs> Red, shut up! Stop being disrespectful, right? Racist? They call local delicacies for a reason. I bet they're delicious. Yes. Let's see. Why we said Gordon Ramsay, a man who knows his food, right? <laughs> in cactus worm. Uh, cactus worm. Delicacy in certain mentally challenged parts of Peru. Delicious. Wonder how he's gonna find it. Oh, look at that, right? It's disgusting. Who would have guessed? No worries, right? How about the Cambodian delicacy of deep fried tarantula? That is delicious. So really delicious. Mmm. But he loves that. Oh no, look at that, right? That tastes like shit too. What a surprise. Absolutely <laughs> disgusting. Oh, how about some Vietnamese snake heart vodka? It's still beating. Oh, snake heart vodka. <laughs> He said delicious. <laughs> I bet it's well delicate and delicious. Oh no, my fault, right? He looks like he's enjoying it as much as a Cardi B song. <laughs> Who the fuck is calling these things delicacies? The locals? Duh. The even the worst <laughs> ones. Listen, some of the foods that people eat around the world are more disgusting than you can imagine. So here's a quick list of the six most disgusting delicacies from around the world. Okay. For 15 minutes of Googling. Uh-huh. In sixth place, deep fried tarantula. Okay. Fucking air. In fifth place, we have those nasty obese. 
no! That's a grub! If you could cook the grub properly, they taste delicious! What the fuck, bro? <laughs> and I just love it that my avatar is covering the ass. <laughs> bro. Yes, balut. It's a duck egg uh, from there's three weeks and six weeks, and you know, and we're s when we say see three weeks, six weeks, which means how much it was incubated. So there will be some that have a heart, a body, a meat, not just an egg. <laughs> Yes. Yep. <laughs> don't open that shit. What the fuck, bro? You don't know how to. You don't even know how to eat it. Of course, it's gonna look disgusting. You just need to open it halfway. Bite it. Put a vinegar. Put some salt. Bite it again. Then. Stop eating it improperly. If you don't know how to eat it properly, don't do it. There's a proper way of eating balut. You're such an idiot. Considering shrimp is actually cold as well as cockroach of the sea, I could see that. For 69, what the fuck? Is that is that even real? A large prone for 69 bucks. <laughs> it's just like cute. What a buck? What a large prone? Two large prawns? The fuck, bro? Who are you? <laughs> is that a Louis Vuitton prawn? Is that what's happening here? <laughs> <laughs> Dogs, right? A virgin boy <laughs> what the fuck is that? What? In this random city in China, right? They find little boys, typically under the age of 10, make them piss in a pot or pan, and then make hard boiled eggs in the pit. What? <laughs> Is that shit? Oh fuck! I think I'm gonna throw up. What the fuck, bruh, 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 Like super cheap Netflix, <laughs> premium for a dollar, free streaming services, 
<laughs> in Argentina? I don't know. Really? And much, much more, which you can get using NordVPN. <laughs> NordVPN.com for <laughs> Okay. Hey, I love the segue. That was a. Uh, I love that segue. <laughs> Oh, nerd. <laughs> for example, right, you can use NordVPN to say you're in Turkey and get Netflix for just $3.65 a month what? instead of 14 What? Mate, that's what? $10 a month. And it works. I've done it myself. Maybe you want to go to Argentina to get YouTube Premium for just over one fucking dollar. What the fuck is that shit? Vietnam to get pay-per-view events for $15 instead of 50 How about India for cheap Amazon Prime Video? Well, Philippines doesn't have Disney Plus though. Unblock YouTube videos, expand video libraries, access free streaming services like all four, which is amazing. May I could go on for days. It's so many better. I'll pop that out if I write me a start. Netflix alone will save you ten dollars a month, right? I know it only cost off three dollars a month, which means it's costing you money to not have Nord. Dude, it was awesome. That, this is an awesome segue though. I love that one. Today! Duh! For the stupidest reason on earth. Cause they don't wanna offend anyone. No, I don't really wanna look at it, it's so disgusting. I'm so sorry, I hope you're not offended. Is she offended? Mate, who cares if she's offended? What is wrong <laughs> with your man? Seriously, right? that's so stupid to me. How can you care so much about not offending people, right? That you're willing to eat whatever the fuck they put in your mouth to not do so. Oh, welcome to my homeland grave. Uh, <laughs> Oh, thanks, mate. What's this? It is dog shit. What the fuck is this shit? What the fuck is this shit? Stupidity. Listen, you wouldn't expect a Jew to have some bacon, right? Or a Muslim to have some whiskey, would you? Right. <laughs> expect me to eat your fucking wife. <sighs> <sighs> now that I think about it, right? To be honest, I bet they're just trolling. I bet they're just as disgusted by their delicacies as we are, right? And they're just messing with us. And do you know what, right? <sighs> I don't blame them. Now imagine being a trial person living in a little hut in the Amazon. Speaking of, I think, yeah. Well-fed, Western privileged, crispy, creamy, and cocksucker who's wasting your time <laughs> recording some stupid show, right? And he asks to have dinner at your place and have some of your hard to come by food. La ha, no, mate. I don't think so. You're not having any of this delicious board that we spent half the day hunting for, right? Absolutely not. Uh, hey, have some special, uh, esperma <laughs> No, what the fuck? <laughs> what the spirit of this? Okay. Oh. Yeah, speaking of, I think uh, spicy coconut wine what was it? Yeah, this one. Oh my god! <laughs> this one. Oh, this one. I don't know. <laughs> okay, did not even know what this is. Okay. <laughs> Okay, in the Philippines, okay, uh, 
there's actually we made wait uh coconut wine we call it lambanog or tuba here in our in my local place and you know i like you know grape wine when it's actually the wine actually expires so but when it expired it's not actually not edible in anymore but it became vinegar okay <laughs> and this one of fuckers <laughs> this one of fuckers frag this dude it's actually a spicy coconut wine <laughs> it's really no it's just a vinegar They just drank vinegar. They <laughs> just drank vinegar with, with lots of chilies in it. And they said it's delicious. <laughs> and it's motherfuckers. <laughs> Bruh. Like. Uh, I know. <laughs> I know what stupidity is, and that's the epitome of <laughs> it. Said, when I saw that on Facebook, I was like, Bruh, are you fucking serious? Did you really fell for that? <laughs> you already thought it's really good. <laughs> but, uh, actually, if you have really, you know, uh, have a time to drink a real coconut wine, it's actually delicious it's actually sweet uh, and smooth kind of thing but when it became a vinegar it became much better you know right you use red wine for <laughs> you use wine for cooking if you use that fucking a coconut vinegar oh my god it's heavenly and just like you know different kind of wine different regions different kind of coconuts give different flavor so i don't know what's um, if the government is doing something about that but and i i think you can press you can stop considering that it expired because the coconut wire wine expires because they don't stop the process you know they just uh, when you make a coconut wine, you know, you take it from the coconut and, you know, use the, actually the natural yeast from the environment. So, it became wine on its own. But, because of that, they don't know how to stop it. We don't, it's not developed yet to stop the process, the yeast, right, to stop the yeast from eating the sugar from the vinegar. So, I mean, from the coconut wine. So, that's why it expired and becomes vinegar. <laughs> If they could find a way to stop it and make it, you know, just wine, it will be a hit. I just think it will be a hit. Like, seriously, though, I want, ah, oh, coconut wine. Have you even tasted coconut wine? If you like eating coconut, oh, damn, what about if, if it became a, a wine, right? And actually, hmm, <laughs> I think I want that to be my magnum opus as well, huh? Huh, right? <laughs> but I, ju I just can't get over, <laughs> you know, uh, vinegar, right? <laughs> oh yeah, I guess it's time. Hey, thanks for hanging out for me with me Adam <laughs> uh, thank you actually it's been a while since I have this much of fun and uh, next stream will be the last stream for Monstrum Nox and after that will I guess I'm going to find a way to buy Portal 2 to use Portal Reloaded so I guess I need to find two box <laughs> I, well, I do have those though, but yeah. <laughs> hey, I got to say, my side, um, cute. Uh, thank you for staying a while and so. Matane! See you!